Okay, in this video I'm going to show you how to set up the face detection feature on the X5C5000 cameras. So, first of all we need to go into the setup menu, enter your password if it prompts you, then we go into the AI option. So you'll see here we've got face detection, so the first thing we want to do is set it up by clicking the cog. So first thing to set up is the pixel size so you'll see here this gives you an idea of the size of the image it's looking for so 32 being the lowest so I'll just give you an idea so that is pretty minute and 1080 being the maximum size so very large more for up close and personal so I shall set it at 80 for this demonstration. You've then got the option to face enhance, uh, enable or disabled. So we'll leave that on disabled at the moment. Face detection, uh, static mode. That's ideal if someone's walking up to the camera and standing in front of it and not moving. Uh, or we've got motion, obviously for people moving around. Okay, so you can either do it by detecting when someone crosses the line so you'll see here I've drawn a line here and then the option to go from A to B or B to A indicated by that little arrow there uh, for this demonstration we will set it up for the rectangle now you can either go full screen so it's detected in the entire entirety of the screen or you can customize the size so if we go customize I shall show you now I shall set it up to only detect on the left side of the fan that you can see in the picture so let's draw a rough square there we then need to save and it'll prompt you when it's completed now if we right click and most important you need to remember to tick the switch this is basically the on and off whether you want it to work or not and then click the apply next thing we need to do is set the schedule up so when do we want this to work so you've got two options here face detection human and vehicle detection so obviously we want the green for face detection so if you left click and hold on the mouse you can drag from top left to bottom right and that will populate the entire screen so that's all the hours of the day and all the days of the week or you can set it up to only operate between certain hours of the day so for example we can just take out between 10 and half past 11 once you've set it up how you want it to work click apply select ok now if we right click and come back out the menu so now if I move in front of the camera you will see that it's detected me and it's as simple as that I hope this helps if you need any further assistance please contact support.y3k.com